Hey guys, welcome back to the War Dog Project 365, episode 963. Guys, if you're following along on YouTube, please jump on over to thewadoc.com. Check out all of our full length videos, that's where we house them. Today, what we're doing is talking a little bit more, or talking about getting a little bit more adductor activation. For those of you guys that don't know what adductors are, they're the muscles that are sitting on the inside of our thighs and have, and when they contract, they make our knees come inwards, right? Now, these muscles tend to get weaker or inhibited, uh, inhibited because we don't use them that much. So we've done lots of plank series uh, on the Wad Doc Show. Most of them work with activating the outside portions of our legs. So we get into a common side plank that might look in a position that looks like this where we come up onto our side we're activating the muscles that are pushing our leg outward right so how can we get better activation on these inside muscles you're going to take yourself a stool or if you're in the crossfit gym a couple blocks or even a couple plates and all you're going to do is you're going to put a stool in front of you you kind of see like how i start to look almost look like i'm humping the chair here okay that's not necessarily what I'm trying to do. <laughs> However, what I am trying to get at is giving myself a prop so the inside portion of my leg is the thing I support off of, okay? I can use a hand for extra support. Start off with an elbow. Now, all the same rules persist. That means that my elbow is below my shoulder and when I pick my hips up, they're stacked, all right? We don't want them to be way out in front or any other direction that could possibly give us some shoulder um, irritation so but the thing is is that all the pressure of the, uh, all the all the pressure that's coming downward is going to be supported on this leg meaning that I'm going to have to push down into the chair get nice activation on those adductors to allow this to work all right so this is what it's going to look like when I get up into a position that looks like this and I'm just going to hold myself for about five to ten seconds okay and then come on down. Wait five to 10 seconds and start a new one, one thousand, two, three, four, five, right? So you're gonna get this activation that also happens in the, in the core. So we're gonna get a good core workout, but we're also gonna get some activation into our adductors. Once we have the hang of this by doing these little five second circuits, we're gonna turn this into a five minute EMOM. We're going to start 10 seconds on, 50 seconds off. As we progress and get better and this becomes easier for us, we can bump up that 10 seconds. Still do a five sec or do, still do a five minute EMOM, but go to 20 seconds. See how you do, okay? Guys, any questions, comments, please post them below. And as always, we are Optimizing Function with Optimized Performance.